so it is our second to last day here. Tomorrow is our last full day here in Costa Rica and we are pretty much completely done with the service project at the school. We just have to do cleanup tomorrow for about an hour and we'll be totally set there and it's going to look really good. Right now I am currently working on writing up my devotional that I'm going to be giving tonight. We've all given a devotional every night together. Um, and tonight it's my turn, which I'm most super nervous about, to be honest with you, because I'm not good at speaking in front of crowds and groups, um, especially in such an intimate environment when you, you know, get talking about, you know, things that you've gone through or whatnot. Um, but I'm honestly pretty excited about it at the same time, so I can I can share things that you know other people might be going through as well that I don't know about or that they might not even realize is like you know just things like that. Um, but I think we're going to spend a little bit of time here at Maximo and then we might head to the beach. Not totally sure yet, but I'll keep you updated. The sun is finally setting and Costa Rica sunsets are absolutely gorgeous. It's going to be very sad to see them go because when you live on the east coast, you don't see the sunset on the beach like this. Not even a little bit. Oh my god, he's so fast. Oh, he why are he looking at me like that? The room is completely cleaned out. Um, this was our room. Six beds, three bunk beds, our little bathroom back there. These windows that give us this beautiful view in the morning and seeing the sun rise above all the trees and whatnot. Um, very sad to go. And the thing is, I have a feeling that we'll be back um, in the near in the future. Um, I feel like God has something special for Costa Rica here, and I feel like we are some of the people that are going to participate in that. And I guess I'm just. As much as I'm gonna miss this country, I'm I'm ready to go home because I know that I wouldn't be going home if it wasn't what God wanted. Because it was either leave leave today or stay through May, and that's a little scary when you don't you only had enough money for one month and not two and a half for three. So goodbye to this. Gorgeous, gorgeous view. It might not seem like much to some of you, but in person, it's absolutely stunning. So we are at the airport. We just checked our bags, which took about an hour in itself, and now we're waiting in a very, very long line, and our flight boards in how long? Uh, it's 11.43, the flight leaves at 1, so that doesn't tell you. Um, this is what it looks like. <laughs> There's stuff everywhere, so. We made it onto the plane, finally, it took probably like two hours. 
like that since we got to the airport. We are sitting all the way in the back because there are there's not 17 of us anymore. There's 13 of us. That's sad. Oh. There's 13 of us. And um, I don't want to go home. Should we just go run off the plane and go find Andy Ray? I mean, Kayla's flight doesn't leave until 120, so she's probably still on the ground. Yeah. I'm down. Down if you are. Grab her and hide her in seats. Yeah, she'll fit. It's fine. We're about to, we're gonna fly into Fort Lauderdale, which, if you know where we live, then Fort Lauderdale's a little bit of a drive. So we probably won't get home till after midnight. So that's gonna be a fun ride home. And we're probably gonna be stopping for food as well. Because we are hungry. It is, what time is it? It is one o'clock. One o'clock. One o'clock. <laughs> it is one o'clock, and we haven't eaten since six thirty this morning when we had breakfast before we left the house. I'm struggling. So I, I had a slim gym, and now I have these cheesy crackers. And because of the coronavirus, they're only doing like they're doing their snacks and drinks things differently. So they're getting us a can of water, they specifically said a can of water, and a snack. We don't know what that snack is yet, which makes me a little nervous, but it better be the pretzels. If it's not the pretzels, I'm gonna be pretty mad. Yeah, I better get, we better get pretzels. But that's all we've got. It has, I mean, it was a little chaotic inside, but we're about to take off, so we'll see you later. Go to the